Won't work. I'm not <laughs> sure I have time for extra assignments, Professor. You shall find the time. Damn! Am I blind or I don't see? Make that 14 and a half inches. Make that long. What kind of spell you do? Yo, the keys, it's Leaza here, and welcome back to some more Hogwarts Legacy. Okay, so. Lumos. No, not Lumos. Levioso. Wow, okay, Levioso. At first, I was like, what is this? I know I could do something with it. Alright, oops. Sorry. Alright, but I'm gonna try to be a, uh, an evil Slytherin or evil witch. Yes, y'all, I'm what a about witch. The room, professor? I know I that thing. The same thing, Deke. Perhaps Deke. you could help. I just call it a thing. Oh my god. Oh, excuse, Deke. Ah, there you are. Hello. I trust your first classes went well. They did, Professor. I heard as much from Professors Hecate and Ronan. Seems Professor Fig taught you quite a bit before you arrived. I'd wager there's a good deal more to your travels here than what you've told me, isn't there? Uh, no. Nothing more, Professor. I see. Like trying to get a sonnet from a streeler. Regardless, you must continue to build upon what you've learned. In that regard, I've asked your professors to help hasten your progress with some extra assignments. Won't work. I'm not <laughs> sure I have time for extra assignments, Professor. You shall find the time. Damn! You'd be astonished to know just how much you don't know. In fact, Professor Ronan will meet you outside momentarily to assign your first one. Now, regarding the trip to Hogsmeade I mentioned earlier. We've arranged to replace the supplies lost on your way here, including seeds, potion recipes, and spell crafts. Thank you, Professor. And Mr. Ollivander will connect you with the perfect wand. About time! You've managed Can your I... classes well with a borrowed wand, but you'll find the magic you cast with your own wand to be far superior. Uh, what mark are you tell me about the potion shop? Okay, yeah, I Can need to know for some information. Shop, Professor. J. Pippin's potions stocks a wide array of potions ingredients, although they rarely sell recipes. Professor Sharp asked that they have a couple of particular recipes on hand for you. Okay. okay. I've never heard of a spellcraft before, Professor. What is it? A spellcraft is a recipe of sorts used when conjuring objects. I shall explain more about them when you begin working with transfiguration magic. Ooh. All right, let's just leave. I'm eager to get to Hogsmeade. Very well. I'd like you to make your first visit to the village with a classmate. Help you get your bearings. Sebastian, come with me? Sebastian Sala or Natsai <laughs> Onai. I've noticed you spending time with them. I'll go with Sebastian. I thought Sebastian. I'd like to go with Sebastian. Glad to hear it. I like Natty. She Sala cool. is a capable young wizard. And he knows the area. He'll keep you well clear of any of Victor Rookwood's undesirables en route. No, that's Rookwood? the reason. A rather unsavory local. Best to avoid him and his associates, including his right hand of sorts, Theophilus Harlow, if you can. Once you've finished Professor Ronan's assignment, your friend will meet you at the castle doors. No time to waste. The sooner you complete your work, the sooner you can enjoy a butterbeer at the Three Broomsticks. All right, I'm about to go with Sebastian. I didn't want to. I did want to choose Natty, but I don't want to take a level one lock. Oh, okay, so I have to be like I have to be a lock picker or something. Okay, so some some missions I can't do if I don't have the right spells or something. All right, let's get out of here. I want to look around though, but what you teach? I don't know what she teach. Let's get out. I don't know, lately the, um... The, the... I've always said that travel... Yeah, I do not want to hear her. <laughs> hey! Let me open. <sighs> I stopped her. Okay, I gotta learn repair from Professor Ronan. 
Then I can start the thing. Oh, I thought she was. I thought they was mad at me. It, just, it looks locked. But I'm just gonna mm -hmm. run over there just to get. Mm -hmm. I don't like that they move and they speak. Oh my god. It's like The Sims. It's a ghost. Oh. Give me that. Yeah, I know which spell to use for that. <laughs> Ooh. Ooh. Oh, is this like a, um... Revelia. A music class? Ooh, no, no, no. Give me that. Akio will be the per... I'm gonna use that all the time. Revelia. What are you up to now? Down. Okay, that's just terrifying how these paintings are talking. You see how it shows a loader screen when the door is about to open? I don't know, it's kind of annoying to me, but hey. Ah, there you are. Oh, you! You told me have Akio. a new spell to teach me, Professor. Indeed I do, and an exceedingly useful one at that, the mending charm, Repero. Fixes things right up, makes a broken object good as new in the blink of an eye. Hmm, it seems as if that might come in handy. More frequently than one would imagine. As Professor Weasley mentioned, I am not the only one who will be teaching you spells outside of class in an effort to catch you up with your peers. A number of your professors have agreed to do so as well, but first, each shall ask that you complete a few preliminary tasks to hone your magic. I have arranged some for today. See them through and then report back to me. <laughs> we will have you casting Rapero in no time. Why must I first complete tasks to learn Rapero? No lesson or lecture can compare to first-hand experience. And these tasks should provide you with just that. Such experience is invaluable when mastering any new bit of magic. But I, I learned the um, Lumos I'll start and all on the that task stuff right as soon as possible. Professor. You could just teach me a prayer. I could get that finished. Okay, search areas on the mini map to represent areas. Okay. Oh, snap. I didn't need to. I don't know why the R2 is the right. This is the right area. I wonder where the flying page is. Rebellion. Oh, I gotta find flying pages. That's easy to find. Ooh. Nope, wrong one. Let me open. Okay. Oh, there it is. Got it. About to be a level four. I'm a level three right now. I know everybody's playing this game right now. They hired at me. They furthered at me. They might already beat the game. The flying page must be around here somewhere. Girl, we see this. Come on. Brilliant. Oh, that count. Revelio. Who are you? Look like it's like a side mission. I need to go over here. Hey, ominous. I've been seeing him a lot lately. What's going on? Never forget what that Hufflepuff girl said in 1421. Oh, what heck a lovely no. stone. Oh, oh heck no. I learned it, sir. I trust the preliminary tasks weren't. I completed the assignment, Professor. Marvelous. You clearly know your way around basic charms. Easy. Let us give the old mending charm a try then, shall we? Remember to be deliberate in your enunciation and movements. I want to see some vigor. Now, wand at the ready. Yes, sir. Hurry this up. I want my own wand. I might get like Remember, a white one. Your wand is a conduit of your magic. Ooh, ooh, let's learn it. This one's very long. Repero. Got it. Can be used to mend broken objects and pieces. Yep. That's it. Very good. I got it. If you would like to practice mending something, Prepare. have a go with that broken statue in the alcove by the water. It allegedly symbolized heartbreak. Perhaps a jilted lover thought it too. Lashed out. Oh, wow. 
All right, all right. We're gonna go with Sebastian. Whoa. Heck yeah. We're gonna do some side quests, but I don't think I'm gonna do it in the video though. Even though I did one with Sebastian, but you know, it's it's you know, if I can't do the main quest, I have to like level up or something. Then... Handy resource indeed, your field guide. I'm Girl, well, you talk to Fancy much. meeting you here. Hey, Sebastian. Hello, Sebastian. We could be ah, besties. My new charge. Excuse me. I'm told you're in dire need of supplies, and I'm to accompany you into Hogsmeade for them. Is this your first foray into the village? It is. Obviously, I haven't left the castle since I arrived. Well. I shall endeavor to be the very best of guides, then. Hogsmeade's a charming little place. Self-contained, too. We should be able to find you everything that you need. Shall we? We shall. Oh my god, we're getting out of the school. When I'm gonna land my broomstick, where I'm gonna use that? Dang, it's like my first day out of school. Yeah, you better run because I was I glad Professor you. Weasley asked me to join you today. As am I. Thank you, by the way. Of course. You're the only one who's ever bested me in Someone a duel. The way I see it, I'd be wise to keep an eye on you. What? <laughs> Sebastian, we should be keeping an eye on you. Speaking of Weasley, she seems to have taken quite a shine to you. Has she? That's nice to hear. I'm still surprised that a professor would entrust me with anything. Given my detention record. See? Spend a lot of time in detention, do you? Just enough to keep me well rounded. <laughs> y'all see his robe? Like, did y'all see that? Speaking of detention, this trip to Hogsmeade might have saved me from one. <laughs> Glad I could be of service. Madam Scribner, the librarian, was on the hunt for me, as is often the case. Professor Weasley came to retrieve me. And I was able to convince old Scribner that I had somewhere to be. So I just helped you out. Okay, I like that. So how did you manage to get on the librarian's bad side? Well, I suspect it's a matter of differing opinions. She thinks I shouldn't be allowed in the restricted section, and I, on the other hand, am inclined to disagree. All right, sorry, you guys. Somebody rang a doorbell. Oh, just one moment. This is an excellent spot to gather lacewing flies. They're pretty to look at. If you stew them long enough, they make a powerful potion ingredient. I'll collect those. I'll collect those. Oh! They sound like horns. Like little squeaky horns. Okay, that's cute. I don't know why that's cute, but that's cool actually. Hey, sir. Trick. Merlin's beard from the Forbidden Forest. Look. What's going on? See for yourself. Quite a sight, isn't it? You certainly don't see that every day. Do you think Poppy Can I have that? The hippogriffs? Absolutely. Like we already know. To the left is the Forbidden Forest, out of bounds to all students. Hence the name. Precisely. They think it's too dangerous. I think they need to have more confidence in our defensive abilities. Ah, you can see Hogsmeade just past those ruins up ahead. Dude is out of breath. Guess he don't. <laughs> you don't exercise a lot, You huh? had much of a chance to explore the castle. A little. It's positively enormous. It is that. I've been there five years and barely scratched the surface. Loads to see, places to discover. Oh, any you'd like to share with the class? Perhaps one day. I can't go around telling you all my secrets now, can I? Yes. You still haven't told me how you became so good at dueling. Well, uh, you know, if you want me to tell you what I had to deal with before I came here, I have I've always mind. thought Thestral's pulling a carriage a bit grim. Though I suppose most people don't actually see them at all. But you can see them. Unfortunately. But you've seen quite a bit yourself firsthand too. Most notably that dragon attack. Hey. Hopefully the rest of your year isn't as eventful. 
Wait, how do you know about that? Did I tell them? Are they new? I know about that dragon. Guess I forgot that dialogue. Mr. Moon! He's the Hogwarts caretaker. Looks a bit worse for wear. Oops, sorry about my Elgato. Hello, Mr. Moon. Have you met our new fifth year? Pleasure! Uh, you might want to turn back, Mr. Sallow. Uh, turn and run. Is everything all right, sir? Oh, it looked right at me! Eyes big as saucers! Huh? What did, Mr. Moon? Demi guys! Ugly and airy and terrifying. I shall be at the castle where it's safe. Good luck to both of you! Right. Demi guys! I don't know what he's putting in his pumpkin juice, but he's obviously had too much of it. I've never seen Mr. Moon in such a state. <laughs> Mr. Moon is quite the character. My sister Anne thinks he's lovely, but I'd say he could improve a bit as a caretaker. Oh, is your sister in Slytherin too? She is, or rather, she was. She's not well at the moment, but she'll be better soon and back at Hogwarts. Okay, I want to meet your sister. Yeah, a fast shovel around here? Because I do not want to run all the way over here. <laughs> Ooh. Honestly, if one could bottle the magic of this place, I don't know if it's the shops or the people, but there's just something about Hogsmeade. We all flock to it like moths to a flame. So how would you like to do this? Weasley told me you had a list of things to get, a wand and some other bits. Yes, Dittany seeds, some spell crafts, and some potion recipes. Perfect. Can't wait to see what you do with the new wand. Can and I customize it? short list gives you plenty of time to poke around the village. I just have to pop into a shop to find something for my sister. Let's meet up in the town circle when you're finished. Okay. Remember, have fun. It's Hogsmeade. Our housing village and you know, different size shops and other points in Okay. Oh, they got a hair shop. So shops. Points of interest. Okay. You can track any these highlight. Okay, first circle to exit. Okay. Alright, so a lot of places I can go. I actually wanna You know the first thing where to go is <laughs> to the hair shop. Let's see, where I gotta go? I gotta go to the, I gotta go to four places? That's crazy. Revelio. I wanna see if anything's gonna reveal. Is that a fast shovel? Oh, can I go in there? Oh snap, I can go in? Not again. Who was in here? Uh, I don't know if I, if I, am I supposed to be in here? What place is this? Leave, leave. Well, first we're going to the hair shop. Game. I actually want to see if there's new hairs. I bet there's not, but. <laughs> like, I like this hair, but you know, I want to try something different. I was going to put like a, uh, like a bun type of hair on my character. Hey, this is Hello. like GTA. Oh, come in, come in. Welcome to Madam Snelling's Tress Emporium. <laughs> I'm sure I've no need to introduce myself. They used to call me Snelly. Oh, Snelly, why aren't you studying to be an aura? But I showed them. They're stuck in the dust at the ministry and I'm here thriving. Absolutely thriving. But look at you. Look at you. I can certainly see why you paid me a visit. Looking for a change, are we? Why not, I say? Which what sort of say? change? Some are going for that. Muggle with consumption, sort of, death becomes me allure. But you won't find poisons here. No need for chloride of lime or ammonia when you have magic. Why don't you spend a moment choosing how you'd like to look? You can change your hair too if you'd like. What services do you offer? Dang, I don't what want to talk What is it you might again? be interested in? Okay, so I was just the same hairs. Okay, I don't know why I just thought it's gonna be such a different. All right, so I changed my hair color to like brown. I'm trying to put it the same hair color as me. I wanted it black because, you know, to be honest, I want to dye my hair black, but I'm not dyeing my hair anymore. So I'm just gonna naturally 
Just wait till my real hair comes back. I mean, real hair color comes back. I said real hair. Real, real hair color comes back. Because I did dye it to like light brown. So that's why. Can I, can I please go to gear? Okay, we're going to go to... I want to get my wand. That's the first thing I want to get. Let's get the wand first. Slytherins almost always use the door to the right of the entrance. Why? Revelia. Lumos. Okay, that's Levioso. No. Revelia. There's something here. Levioso. Lumos. There's something here. I Revelia. saw you. Oh. I had to get close to it. Oh snap, it's the wand shop. Let me in. Oh, I was just here, actually. That's hilarious. I was just here. I'll be right with... Ah, it's you. Um, just a moment, please. Uh, mm. Hello, sir. I'm looking for... For a new wand, yes. It's about time. Yes, It's I... about that time. About time. Well, you're our new fifth-year student, are you not? Oh, what am I saying? Of course you are. Gerbold Ollivander's the name. But of course, you'll have heard of the Ollivanders, I'm sure. Finest wand makers in the world. It's a pleasure to meet you, truly. Now, come with me. Let's find you the perfect one, shall we? Hmm, uh, no, 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 not you. Um, ah, yes. I knew it. Yes, hmm, powerful core. Ten and a half inches? Hmm, you might do. Here, give this one a try. Oh, that's so basic. Can I change well, how it ahead. looks? Swish. Hmm, how odd. Uh, once more, come on, really swish it. Okay. Firecrackers. Fireworks. Well, this isn't a good match at all, is it? <laughs> uh, um, we'll find you something, not to worry. Mm, no, not you. Uh, How can you uh, tell? Mm, perhaps, yes. A rare wood, 13 and 3 quarter inches, dragon heart string. Let's give this one a try. This better work. Oh, goodness. Uh, looks like it's back to the shelf for you. Do, do you know uh, what's my wand? This is proving to be trickier than I had anticipated. How perplexing. Um, where are you? Perhaps you? Uh, ah, there you are. This better be it. Think you might be the one. Here, take it. Just she hesitated because, like, is it it? Oh. oh, how intriguing! I like that you can change it. I don't know why I want a white. Oh, that's gray, classic gray. Curious indeed. Natural good. What are you trying to say, sir? I just want a white one. I don't know why. I just like, I feel like that's just like different for everybody else's, you know? Oh, I could change the wood type. Oh, heck yeah. Hold on. Curious indeed. Am I blind or I don't see? Make that. 14 and a half inches. Make that long. Curious indeed. Oh, I think it's changing. I don't know. Very flexible, quite bendy. Curious indeed. Keep talking, sir. We like it. A dragon heartstring wand is most powerful and learns quickly. 
Okay. Say something about the unicorn. Capable of producing a great range of magic. Hmm. The hair. A unicorn hair wand is most reliable and faithful to its owner. All right, sorry you guys. I just looked over and I saw my Elgato twitching a little bit. So if you guys saw it in the video, I apologize. I don't know what's going on with my Elgato. It does take a lot, like the actual game capture takes a lot of GPU or CPU, whatever it takes. So it be glitching up and I don't know why it is sometimes because that's the only thing that's open in Audacity. Like how much you think so I'm gonna choose the dragon heartstring. I don't know how many wands. I think we could buy a lot of wands, but I'm gonna use the dragon how heartstring. How intriguing! And then we got perch. I don't even know how much this all costs. What do you think? I don't know why, but I wanted a white one, and it looks cool. Extraordinary. <laughs> another wand, another beginning of a bright and magical future. <laughs> okay, we got a what? How did that feel? Good. Different. I sensed a sort of surge of some kind. A match. Your connection seemed particularly powerful. The right wand will learn from you, just as you learn from it. I'm eager to try it out. I would imagine so. A wand with a dragon heartstring core is capable of dazzling magic. And the bond between you and your wand should only grow stronger. Do not be surprised at your new wand's ability to perceive your intentions, particularly in a moment of need. That sounds wonderful, Mr. Ollivander. I'll let you get to it. Do come and see me again, if ever I can be of further assistance. Okay. Oh. Okay, you just slide through there, huh? Broomstick! Oh my god, can I get one? What place is this? Am I gonna get a broomstick? Revenia. Give me that. Alright. There's a lot of stuff we can do out here. Challenge complete. Uh, there's a flying book around. Can I go upstairs? I think there's a... Oh! Just eat it for free in here? I can't... Well, say I can't run? What is this? GTA? Rockstar? Red Dead that I can't run? There's a chest around. Oh my god. Okay, got money. I need to collect a lot of money because I've been... No, I feel like I'm gonna use all my money on stuff. Okay, got more money. Never mind, we're good. Revelio. Anything out here? This is yellow, so like. Left one lock. Okay, there it is. Give me that. What's this? Money. It's a lot of lockpicks. I, I guess I have to learn that uh, that spell. I knew. Uh, I thought that was a flying paper. I was about to use Akio on it. Okay. Finding money. Dude, I have to go in the back. Where am I going? <laughs> An inquiring mind. Hey. What you got in here? Oh, snap. I just built a freaking stairs. Hold on, sir, before we talk. What's up here that you got that I can steal? It's a flying page. Thank you. We're about to be level five in no time, y'all, maybe before this video ends. Which is going to be a lot. To Rebellion. Okay, this chest out here. Oh, see? Level five. Pardon me, sir. I'm here for the spell crafts Professor Weasley ordered. Matilda, student. I thought I might be seeing you soon. I am the proprietor here. Thomas Brown. 
I take it you've had a conjuring lesson then? I'm afraid I haven't yet, sir. Not yet. Ah, but you will soon enough. It is magic at its purest, creating something out of nothing. Of course, it is not without complexity, but that is where my spellcrafts come in. Stay the course, and you could soon impress even Professor Weasley. That's certainly something to aspire to, Mr. Brown. I look forward to that day. And I, too, see in it. Spellcrafts are incredibly useful for conjuring unique items like custom pieces of furniture or decoration. But I shall let Professor Weasley do the teaching. For now, let's get the spellcrafts you need. A potting table and a potion station, yes? I believe so, sir. Good. Nothing like being able to grow your own ingredients and brew what you want, when you want. Let's have a look. Okay. Let's look at what we have, shall we? <laughs> if you're interested, feel free to take a look around at the rest of my inventory. Oh, some of these stuff actually helps with my... Oh, the outfits that you wear does help with your combat. Like, offense, defense, more powerful, all that. I could go in your room. Oh my god, I got an outfit. Ravenia. This was the chest I was seeing. <coughs> I really don't want to put that mask on, but it does help my... Offense or something? Helps something. Okay, let's leave. Ooh. What what class are you in? What room are you in? What yellow is that? I don't know too much about all the different I know Slytherin. I heard Huff and Puff. Hufflepuff. That's about it. Um I don't know the other ones. Is this it? Rebellion. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Fast travel right here. Oh, flying book. Flying book. I need three more. Can I go down? Revenia. I don't know how I'm gonna get those chests. Look like there's another fast travel somewhere around here. Ooh, golden silk robe. Hold on. Ooh, that don't look right. No. Are you gonna teach me some spells or something? Or do I have to collect some stuff? Pardon me, sir. Oh, thank goodness. When I heard the bell, I thought you were Miss Lawang. Not that she deigns to come here. Though, I don't believe I've seen your face here before, either. It's my first time in Hogsmeade, actually. Is it really? Well, Parry Pippin at your service. And Perry this Pippin. is J. Pippin's potions. Potions for all ailments. <laughs> You'll have read it on the sign, of course, but Grandfather always made me say it in full. <laughs> How may I help you today? Professor Weasley sent me to collect some recipes. I'm new at Hogwarts. You're the student she sent the owl about. I set your things aside immediately. I suspected if you're anything like I was at your age, you'd want your potion supplies. Is it not the most fascinating art potion making? Rivals anything you can do with a wand, I've always said. Are potions really that versatile? They may not be as showy as spell work, but make no mistake, they are just as powerful. They can heal, destroy, protect. You'll discover all of this soon enough. As it's your first time in, I should mention that it's not just potion recipes I sell. I also offer ready-made drafts for all manner of uses, and I unveil new ones from time to time. Pop in when you can so you don't uh, miss out on anything. Hmm? But for now, let's get you those recipes, shall we? Yes. What can I do for you today? Feel well, free to take a look at the rest potions? of my inventory, or come back another time if you're in a rush today. I don't want to buy these stuff yet, because I don't know what to do with those. Okay. I could sell anything at 
all these people, if they have a sale thing, I thought it was just certain things. Okay, there's a lot of stuff around. It's mostly lockpicks, so I'm kind of, I'm kind of confused. I'm gonna learn that soon. Do I use for parry on the lockpick? Oh, well, hello there. Hello. Hello indeed. I need two more than I complete that challenge, I guess. Sorry, sir. Just wow, you got some big pumpkins out there. What's going on? That'd be great for Halloween. Pardon what me, am I sir. Saying? I'm here for the seeds <laughs> Professor Weasley arranged for me to collect. Oh, the Dittany for the new fifth year. <laughs> I take it that's you then. Merlin's beard. Starting Hogwarts is a fifth year. You must be positively reeling from it all. Not at all. I'm choosing to see it all as one big adventure. Well, bravo. Not everyone has the temperament to take things as they come. Name's Timothy Teasdale, by the way. And this is my shop, the Magic Neep. I keep the cart out here because I like a good chat. Can't very well be in the thick of things if I'm hidden away inside now, can I? I suppose not. In addition to seeds, I have plenty of plants. Grow everything myself. My speciality is potion ingredients. Even Pippin purchases from me. But what say we get you a packet of Dittany seeds? Let me guess. You're after something fresh. Yeah, I'm just gonna free stuff. Around. Plenty of ingredients to pique your interest, I'd wager. Well, I'm that's kinda everything. broke. Better go and find Sebastian. Alright, where's Sebastian at? Okay. I've been adventuring too long. Sebastian's waiting for me. I mean, I could go I could go here either way. I don't know why I can't speak lately. I think it's because <laughs> I can I'm gonna keep saying it. Got my own room. I I'm gonna chat it up now. What well, am then, I yeah. chatting it up? Hmm. Alright. I'm mostly gonna read those when I edit so I can know what they are for. Okay. Sebastian, hey. How we doing? I officially have all of my supplies. Excellent. Did you get what you needed for your sister? I did. So I suppose the world is our oyster now. Let's see what else we can get up to. The heck is that? How did I get here? Oh my god. Are we are we are we Oh yeah, you guys are you guys got spells. Magical powers, this will be easy. What the Draw it away from the building! Away from the village! What's it? Are we gonna help? Wow, there's two of them. Are we dodging now? Thank you. So, in the case red, that's where we had to dodge. Okay. Don't <laughs> use that on him. Keep at it. We'll wear him down eventually. What kind of spell you do? <laughs> oh, I should have blocked. What was that? A taste of his own medicine. Yup. Yup. Yo. Woo! I know what I'm doing. Ooh. Ooh. Oh, I could have blocked that. I forgot how to block. How did you? Oh, it's, I think it's all triangle. Oh, yeah, yeah, it's all triangle. 
Yeah, I should have. I should have done it. Ha! Woo! Dang! I got hit after that. This is our, our power up move. I just slaughtered that thing. Goodness, a second troll. Did you two take on a fully grown troll by yourselves? I suppose Two of y'all should have stayed. It's all a bit of a blur, to be honest. Merlin's beard. Are you all right? We are, and we were glad to help. I'd say help is a bit of an understatement. Nerve like that? The makings of an aura, if you ask me. If you are unharmed, perhaps the two of you wouldn't mind helping me put a few things back to where they were. Of course. That's when I use repair. Singer. Officer Singer. And thank you, again. No problem. The heck? Repair. Is he gonna help? Lucky they didn't do me much. I'll go and see what he wants. Please. Then he running into the room, into that building. See, this is actually amazing. Just having powers like this, just to repair everything like that. Come on now. So you could destroy anything, you can just repair right back. Look at that. Repair. Excuse me. Use that. Look at that. Oh, it's not. I did that? Wait, is that a flying? It is. That comes first. Alright, I did it. Prepare. So is that cotton candy? Ooh, is that a candy store? Can I go in there? Ooh, I don't want to. I want to go in there. Oh, so I did not know you can. What's this? I gotta repair these things? Come on, that's kinda extra. Oh, that's very extra. That, I can see why it fell. <laughs> Alright, speak to the shopkeeper. Oh my god, I'm gonna get a broom? Mr. Hill was just singing your praises. Rebellion. Hold on, sir. I'm about to get a broom. Are you gonna teach me a new spell? Alright, I'm just looking around. Hello, sir. I don't believe we've met. Allow me to introduce myself, uh, Augustus Hill, Clothia Extraordinaire. I should like to thank you for your remarkable bravery in fighting those trolls, and not to mention your help restoring Hogsmeade to its rightful state. I was happy to help. Frankly, you deserve an Order of Merlin, but I can offer you something much more useful. I own Gladrag's wizard wear and among my inventory oh, are some unique items that afford certain protections, as it were. Life-saving protections. And as I suspect this won't be your last dangerous encounter, I'd like to give you one such set of robes. In thanks for what you did today. Thank you. Thank you, Mr. Hello? Hill. That's Thank very you. generous of you. What it's I... the least I can do. So uh, no. Now, now let's try this on for size, shall we? Why would I decline Plenty that? Plenty for your perusal today. Take your time. I hope this looks good. Really? A Slytherin one? Okay. I get it for free. You can wear Are you serious? I know what to do. The current defense outfits are just yeah. I think the purple stuff is more power extraordinary. Yeah. See the glasses. <laughs> okay, so I bought a. Uh... I'd say we've earned a butterbeer or two, wouldn't you? Might help me forget that I was almost pulverized by a troll. I'd say that I agree with you. Perfect. The three broomsticks is just this way. <gasps> we've got to get a broomstick. I sell even more battle worthy oh, items. Should you be inclined? Ooh, okay. Alright, there we go. Wand handles. 
So you couldn't have a lot of wands. Okay, that's cool. Because I, I might want that pink wand now. <laughs> oh, I have to be a level 6 for that? I don't know. I am a level 5. Okay, so certain outfits I can't wear because it would be a certain level. Alright, this is my fit, you guys. Hope y'all like it. Uh, this I think I might be outside for that. All right, Sebastian, what we got? Where are we going? The three brooms. Assuming it isn't utter bedlam in there, we might even meet Serona, the owner. She's a good one to know. Serona. Okay. The heck? Oh. Oh, he my said God. you could get to the child when they came to Hogsmeade. That all you needed was a distraction. I gave you a distraction. I just watched a student take down your distraction. <laughs> Who's this child? What are you not telling me? All you need to know is that if you cannot get to the child, then you have no value to me. Let's go. Oh, he saw me. Did he they see looking... us? Yes. I don't think so. What was that goblin doing with Victor Rookwood? Ranrock is working with Rookwood. The goblin from the Daily Prophet. I knew I'd seen him somewhere. Quickly, let's get inside the three broomsticks. Bro. Rag Rag Rock saw y'all. Well, mostly it's me. It's a treat to see you, Lord Gok. I shall let you know if I hear anything. Thank you, Serona. You be well. Serona, I need help. Hello. I guess he's looking at my outfit. Now, what can I? Oh, there's a face I haven't seen before. It's my first time here. Welcome. Butterbeer's on me. I could you beer? Heard about the attack. I shall be looking in on the other shopkeepers and residents shortly. Glad to see you two escaped injury. Thanks to this one. Single-handedly took down a troll. Is that right? Well done. Thank you for this. My pleasure. I will say... <sighs> trolls in Hogsmeade. That's never happened before. Something's not right. The only brand we rock, usually have rock, to deal with. Ran rock. Oh. Oh, time, lame. Was that Lodgok I saw leaving just now? <laughs> Your clientele's not what it used to be, Serona. Not to worry, Victor. Once the two of you leave, the caliber of my clientele will greatly improve. I wouldn't do that if I were you, Theophilus. Come now. No need for theatrics. I'm only here for this one anyway. My friend is enjoying a well-earned butterbeer. Only want a quick word. Perhaps you didn't hear me. Ooh! It's like Red Dead, but with wands. My friend is busy. One would think you all had enough bloodshed for one day. Come, the Ovenus. The Three Broomsticks isn't what it used to be. Let's take our galleons elsewhere. Yeah, yeah. Can't drink butter beer forever. All right, Serana, you know what you're doing? Seems you've made an unfortunate enemy. Watch your back. Rookwood and Harlow are worse than any troll you might encounter. I can beat them up. Trolls? Ranrock and Rookwood? What are you not telling me? I promise to tell you everything. But it's perhaps best I do that later. Mm. And on that note, I think we should head Rebellion. back to the castle. Okay. Thank God she helped me out. I'm just gonna take your foot. Wasn't I here before? I think I was here. Three broomsticks. Am I gonna get a broomstick? Like. 
I'm certainly glad Serona was there. Right. Told you she was one of the good ones. I can see that. She didn't seem at all intimidated by Rookwood and Harlow. I think you'll need to tell me why Victor Rookwood has you in his sights. But we can talk later. For the moment, we should return to the castle. Professor Weasley's certain to hear about the troll attack soon if she hasn't already. Don't want to risk another detention for getting back after hours. Feels like it's already late. Oh, we can't stay during the day. Okay. This game thought I'd... Okay, we're going back to our dorm. Is nobody here? Like, nobody comes in here? There's like four beds. Well, three beds in here. And nobody's here. It's already daytime for y'all. Level six. Read mail. All right, so you guys. Okay, I will be sent with characters. I require request updates for you. Oh, okay. Come see me. I discovered something in the locket we found at Grig Gods. Okay, perfect. I guess when there's nothing to do, I get like a little letter because I was confused what it where to go okay so good talk to professor fig all right so i'm gonna stop it here y'all i really don't know oh this is where i read my mails okay perfect i'm gonna stop it here you guys hope you guys enjoyed this video um it's getting really really good i don't know when we're gonna get our broomstick because i would like to fly to my destination <laughs> that'd be amazing but um yeah so i hope you guys enjoyed this video make sure to leave a like comment and subscribe i apologize if it's too long but if it's long and you guys are enjoying it i'm glad that you guys have enjoyed the series so far and yeah anyways i'll see you guys in the next video thank you so much for watching and i'll see you guys in the next video i keep saying the same thing every time but yeah peace out you guys yeah 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 i can make you famous i can make you crazy I